If someone's been injured, they should contact a solicitor as soon as they feel able to do so after the accident while things are fresh in their mind. The sort of cases that we would regularly see are people involved in road traffic accidents, accidents at work, trips on the pavement, dog bites, pretty much any type of accident may lead to a claim depending on who's at fault. The solicitor can guide them through the litigation process and um, take the stress away from them, um, point them in the right direction in terms of what sort of rehabilitation they may need. It's not just a question of compensation. Um, for a lot of people, they need more than that. There are two types of damages. People can make a claim for pain, suffering and loss of amenity, which is the, um, the damages and compensation they receive for the injury. Then there is a second type of damages called special damages, where the client is put back in the position they would have been if the accident hadn't have happened. So they will be reimbursed expenses and loss of earnings and any out-of-pocket expenditure they've been put to as a result of the injury. Claims can settle at court and claims can settle well before they go to court. Um, it depends on the nature, complexity and value of the claim as to whether it needs to go to court or not. I would normally advise any client to allow at least six to nine months for a personal injury claim to pursue. That is because we have to wait for medical evidence. It's dangerous to try and settle a claim too soon. Some cases, however, can settle very quickly. The vast majority, I would say, nine months to a year. There's quite a few initial steps that need to be taken in order to preserve the evidence um, that is available um, to determine who's at fault for the accident and to then help the client decide whether they should proceed with a claim and how much compensation they'll be entitled to receive. My usual rule of thumb is that a case should be settled within one year of proceedings being issued. However, it really depends on um, what type of injury you suffered because if you suffer a very serious injury, then it's not going to be for six months or a year after the accident before you even start to realise the extent of the injury and how long it's going to take to recover from. Most clients are, are interested in pursuing a claim on the basis of a no win, no fee agreement what we call a conditional fee agreement. If we are successful, then they will recover most of their legal costs from the opponent, but not all of them. And they normally have to pay a contribution, often capped at 25% of their damages. The vast majority of personal injury claims that we would see are dealt with by negotiation. I would say very few end up in court, but that depends on how complex they are, how contentious they prove. Uh, more often than not, cases are settled by agreement and at a fairly early stage.